I'm Nadika Vizwakula for Investment Pitch Media. Red Pine Exploration assays unexpected gold zones at the Wawa Gold Project. Highlights include 2 grams per tonne over 11.28 meters. Red Pine Exploration's latest drill results include the discovery of three new gold zones east and west outside of its Sir Luga Deposits 43101 resource, as well as mineralization further at depth. Highlights include a new discovery east of the Sir Luga deposit grading 2 grams per ton gold over 11.28 meters, including 6.13 grams per ton over 3.15 meters. A discovery hole west of Sir Luga with assays including 4.72 grams per ton over 2.77 meters and a further discovery west with grades including 5.13 grams per tonne over 1.8 meters. The Wawa Gold Project comprises a large 6,519 hectare property located two kilometers outside the town of Wawa in the prolific gold mining area in northern Ontario, home to several of Canada's largest current and past producing gold mines. The Wawa Gold Project includes a current NI43-101 resource of about 700,000 ounces in two deposits. 205,000 ounces at 5.31 grams per tonne indicated and 396,000 ounces at 5.22 grams per tonne inferred at Sir Luga and 25,000 ounces of 7.5 grams per tonne indicated and 75,000 ounces of 6.6 .6 grams per tonne inferred at Minto Mine South. Over 95% of the contained ounces at both deposits are located between surface and 350 meters in depth, with both deposits remaining open at depth. Drilling below the Sir Luga deposit successfully showed that the mineralization of the deposit extends at depth. The results from the hole 282 indicated that higher grade mineralization occurs in the down dip extension of the structure that hosts the Sir Luga deposit. Holes 281 and 282 successfully extended the known strike length of gold mineralization in the Minto B shear zone to the north. The new mineralized structure discovered in hole 283 shows the new zones of mineralization are possible in the foot wall of the Sir Luga deposit, parallel to the Jubilee shear zone. Future drilling in this down dip extension could lead to the discovery of new gold bearing structures that could host significant zones of gold mineralization and thereby extending the Sir Luga deposit. Higher grade gold mineralization beneath the Sir Luga deposit assaying 5.21 grams per tonne over one meter in a partial intersection with further results from the intersections beneath the Sir Luga deposit in holes 283 and 284 are still pending. Quinton Yari CEO stated, the new gold zones in the hanging wall and foot wall of the Sir Luga deposit indicate that new discoveries are still possible and continue to be uncovered near and beyond the footprint of the current resource. Also, results to date show that the resource can not only be expanded at depth but also laterally. We now have evidence of the continuity of gold mineralization over a strike length of 1 km in the Horn Blend Shear Zone and 800 meters in the Minto B Shear Zone, with both zones remaining open along strike and at depth. Six additional gold-bearing structures have been identified on the property that combined form the Wawa Gold Corridor, a structure that extends for more than 6 km on the property. These gold bearing structures include the Cooper, the Horn Blend, the Grace Mine, the Minto B, the Park Hill No. 4, Minto Lower, and the southern extension of the Jubilee Shear Zones. The shares are trading at 3 cents. Extensive information of the company's history, technical reports including the recently updated NI43101 resource update and pass results are available on the company's website at redpineexp.com and all the videos covering their news are available on our website at investmentpitch.com. Contact Mia Boiridi, President at 416-364-7024 
Email mboahid at redpineexp.com or Quinton Yari, CEO at 416-364-7024. Email qyari at redpineexp.com. I'm Nadika Vizwakula for Investment Pitch Media.